Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, Lazy Sundays. And if it's the first time you visit my channel, welcome. My name is Tiffany, and today I'm going to share with you guys new beauty products that's recently launched by Urban Outfitters. It's called Oh Hi Beauty. It was supposed to be a first impression video, but I filmed this before and I actually lost all of the footage, so I had to refilm this. <laughs> I already used all these products. But I'm just gonna tell you guys what I like, what I don't like about it, even though I already know what I like and what I don't like about it. Yeah. Before we get started, please do subscribe down below to Lazy Sundays and make sure to hit that bell shit button so you don't miss any of my future videos. And let's get started. To beat my face. As you can see, I'm currently wearing the thin layers of foundation on my face because Oh High Beauty doesn't carry any foundation products. But in case you guys are wondering what foundation I'm using, I'm using this. It Cosmetics CC Plus All the Correcting Full Coverage Cream So yeah, this is what I'm using right now on my face Very thin layers though And my shade is medium 10 So I'm gonna start with this Oh Hi Beauty Magic Hair Wand Basically you can use this on your hair, like your baby hair Or your, um, your brows And I'm just gonna use it on my brows I'm just gonna apply this for now And then later on I'm gonna apply some color to it. It definitely let my brows set in place, but I will wish this is like more tinted because I like tinted brow gels. But yeah, I can tell why this is not tinted because they're using it for your hair as well. So I'm just going to use my Anastasia brow pencil and then just finish off the brows for now. Now I'm going to do my eyes and I'm going to use this awesome palette. Uh, this is one of their palettes. I believe they came out with two palettes. I just got one. This is the Treasure Eye palette. And look how beautiful this is. Seriously though, like, I'm obsessed. I'm gonna try to use as many colors as possible and then try to show you guys what it looks like on my eyes. Um, with a brush or with my fingers. But I'm gonna tell you that right now that these colors are very pigmented and they're really blendable and I'm gonna show you guys how and stuff like that. But I've used it already so I'm like, so excited to show you guys. First, I'm going to use this pink peach color to apply over my eyelid as a base. Yeah, I'm just going to apply that lightly. So now I'm going to use this pomegranate color. Looks like this. Apply this in the outer corners of my eyes and like slowly blend it in. I feel like I'm gonna go for like a natural look today, but you know me with natural look, that never turned out to be natural. <laughs> so I'll try. I think I'm gonna use this color Anise. Looks like this. It's really pigmented. It's like basically like the other color but matte. <laughs> so just apply a little bit outer corners and kind of blend it in a little bit, just like gradually. Give my eyes a little bit more dimension. So I'm just gonna apply this like this. Kind of dab it with my uh, finger. So now I'm gonna use this gold color. Look at that. This is the reason why I got it. Look at this. It looks so pretty. I'm gonna apply this. Kind of like in the, in the corners. Blend it in with a clean brush, even though this is probably not clean. Like this. Oh my god, it looks so pretty. For my bottom lashes, I'm going to use this color. And closely to my lash line. So now I'm going to do a little wane with this charcoal eyeshadow. Uh, I'm just going to use an angle brush. I think my eyes are done. I think I really like it. It looks like a sunset. For this palette, I actually used 6 colors out of 10. I'm pretty proud of myself. Yes. Um, but I try to avoid uh, the pink one and the purple one just because I already have a video on my Norvina palette and that's basically the, all that colors. If you guys want to check it out, I will link it down below to, in the description box and also at the card up there. But these colors are basically really pretty as well. So this is the pink one. 
ta-da! And then it looks like this. And then this is a really bad swatches, sorry. <laughs> and then the purple one, the purple shade is this color. It looks really pretty. It looks pretty. Oh, such a bad swatch, but this is basically the color. This is so pretty. I can definitely use this on my cheeks. Anyway, I really like this palette. I believe this palette is only $25 and it's really affordable consider that you have 10 shades um, and they're really pigmented and also they're really blendable. But the only thing I will say though is the packaging. It's probably the reason why it's affordable because the packaging is just cardboard paper. I don't like it that much just because um, it gets dirty easily. Just the packaging I don't really like. Some of the shades or some of the eyeshadows, like the squares, might be popping out soon. So I'm gonna move on to my lashes. Over here I have this mini mascara from Ohio Beauty. The first, I thought this is the wand, but the wand's over here. It's so long. I feel like it's deceiving somewhat. <laughs> surprised that I like this um, mascara just because they're so tiny. You can really go through each and individual lash and then like make sure that they're well coated with the mascara. So I apply my mascara but I don't think you can actually tell just because um, yeah they're not that you know dramatic. But I do like this mini mascara. The wand is really tiny that you can go into your like uh, inner corners of your eyes to apply those lashes that usually you won't reach. To be honest, I like my lashes to be longer and more dramatic because I do have like Asian lashes which goes right down and really short so I need to have all the help I can get. <laughs> if I don't want to wear fake lashes, I have to wear like these kind of mascara so that my lashes will actually show. I like this just for, you know, my bottom lashes and also my inner corners of my lashes. But overall, uh, I will apply this and then on top of that, I will apply my Hourglass Caution Mascara just because this actually gives my lashes that boost I need. Onto my under eye, I'm gonna brighten up a little bit. I'm gonna use this Oh Hi Wake Up Pan. So I'm just going to apply this right here. This is not marketed as a concealer, but it's just meant to like brighten up your eyes a little bit. Honestly, I don't think this does anything to me <laughs> on my face. Let's highlight my face and I'm going to use their soft glow highlighter. This is in the shade Cosmic Jasper. This is a more like a yellow tone highlighter. And honestly, I do like these, but they're really oily. When I've applied this, I feel like I'm applying oil to my face. Like, it's not creamy, it's oily. There's a difference. <laughs> but I do like the way it turns out, because you can tell. It gives you that natural glow, that kind of glow from within kind of look, um, which is what they're marketing for. But to me, I just think the formula is a little bit too oily for me. But it applies really nicely to your face, so if you guys like that kind of stuff, also, I did not know how big this was on the website. I thought it would be like a tiny one. I'm not complaining. I like big palettes. I feel like you get more out of your buck. Now let's move on to my lips. This is their lip jelly and this is basically like a lip balm. I absolutely love this. This is my favorite lip balm of all time right now. This gives me like a new lip. It feels so good, oh my god. Your lips will instantly feel like moisturized and protected. It's just so good for like fall and winter when my lips are chapped or dry. They're always dry, so. And now I'm gonna use this Ohi True Matte Lip and I'm gonna apply this on my lips. This is a color icon. I actually really like it. I'm surprised. I feel like this kind of reminds me of like M Cosmetics Lip Cloud. If you guys ever tried that, it's really light, but it's like it's matte. It's not drying out your lips. Considering that I have tried other lipstick, this one's actually really easy to apply, so I like that. Let's 
So yeah, that's it guys. This is the whole makeup look. I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys give these products a try. I actually really like these. I think my favorite definitely is the lip balm and also the, the eyeshadow palette. And if you guys do give these products a try, let me know how you feel about these in the comments down below. I hope you guys enjoy watching this video and if you guys do, please do give me a thumbs up and definitely subscribe down below to Lazy Sundays. And if you guys happen to have Instagram, please do follow me over there as well. I do post a lot more on my Instagram, which is also Lazy Sundays. And I also do have a personal blog, which is beauty and style related. And if you guys want to check it out, I will link it down below. It's LazySunday.com and also I will put it in the card over there. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!